Now our class, we are going to teach you how to identify which particular light bulb will be brighter. Um, so the two variables will be the batteries and the number of light bulbs. So now, let's start. Huh? So let's say we have a battery here in a circuit. Then we have light bulb A. Right? Compared to we have another battery here in another circuit here and then we have light bulb B and C so which light bulb will be brighter is it A B or C so how do we know so basically we'll use a ratio method to see which light bulb is stronger firstly we'll all we will look at the number of battery here. So one battery, right? So it's one. Then you look at the two ends of a battery, right? When it comes here. So these two ends here cover, encompass this particular light bulb. So there's only one light bulb. So this particular uh, battery, A, the brightness will be one, divide by one, right? So one battery encompasses one bulb here. So the brightness is one. Then what about this one? So this is one battery, again it's one. But now it encompasses two light bulbs. There are two light bulbs under his arm, two arm. So there are two light bulb BC. So BC will have the same brightness. And how bright is it? So it's one battery, two light bulbs. So it's half. Right? So which one is stronger? Is it one that is stronger or half that is stronger? So obviously it's one. So this A will be brighter than these two. Then B, C, they have the same brightness. So this is example one. Ta-da! This is example two. Let's save some paper. Example two, we have here two batteries in series so we add them up there are two batteries so we always use battery number of battery divide by number of bulbs so yeah so that will tell us the brightness remember it's number of battery divided by number of bulbs so there are two batteries here then under this uh, within these two battery there are two light bulbs a and b so divide by two so the brightness is one for this one so both are one then what about this one this one one battery and encompass one light bulb so this is also one then who is brighter no there's we can't compete because they are all the same of the same brightness a b c of the same brightness because they are all one Bling. now we are at example three so now we have three battery so 3 divide by two light bulbs in between so we have 1.5 so the brightness of this a or b they are all 1.5 now what about this one there are two batteries here divide by one so this is two now who is brighter now so this is 1.5 this is 2 so c is brighter than a and b a and b has the same brightness because they are in the same path under these three batteries now let's look at example 4 example 4 is a parallel circuit so these two batteries we uh, maybe we have to familiarize when they are in the same line we say that they are in series. So this battery and this battery are in series. These two light bulbs are in series because they are in the same line. Now, this bulb A they are, is in this line. Bulb B and C, they are in another path or another line. Maybe I'll use path is better. This path and this path. So what's considered a path, right? When we say currents are flowing from the positive out here, when you reach here, there are two paths that the current can, can flow. So this is one path, 
when the current reach here right this, this is one path this is another path so when the two paths have the same starting point and the same ending point we say that this path and this path can you see the same starting point and same ending point so this path and this path are parallel so now which light bulb is brighter now if we have this kind of situation so again this is a battery there are two batteries so two for for a eh? so we have two two batteries so from here can you see under these two path under sorry not under under these two battery this path only have a so it's two divided by one and a is inside so brightness of a is two then what about this path can you see so these two batteries also goes to these two light bulbs so this two battery two light bulb based on this path so under b and c so two divided by two we have one so b and c the brightness is one they have the same brightness because they are on the same path then what about a a the brightness is two so a is brighter than b and c okay now another example this is um, this path is parallel to this path this path is parallel to this path so we have three parallel path here three batteries so now a what is the how bright is a so a let's push it up a little bit so for a we have three batteries from here to here one a so it is divided by one so the brightness is three b and c same path from the battery go to this b and c there are two of them here so under b and c we have three batteries divide by two balls so we get a 1.5 then what about the last one d e f so we have three batteries this path one two three so d e and f we have three divide by three equals to one so now who is the brightest a a has got the brightness of three b and c same brightness brightness is 1.5 not as big as three and d e f brightness is one so who is the brightest a which is this one okay last example so we have two circuits under these two circuits tell, can you tell me which light bulb or light bulbs will be the brightest so now we have here for bd is on the same path three batteries so these three batteries encompasses this two encompass these two uh, light bulb so for b and d so for b and d we have three battery divided by two light bulb so the strength is 1.5 yeah then now look here so under a and c a and c we have two batteries here these two battery encompass a and c two light bulb so it's a c we have two battery divided by two light bulbs the brightness is one right so from here at this moment 1.5 is stronger then now we look at this one f two batteries encompass one light bulb so it's f two batteries divided by one light bulb equals to two so who is the strongest now two so it's f is the brightest who is the least bright will be a and c same brightness but they are least bright the medium one the center one will be b and d